today. So, Seth, we appreciate you joining us today. Um, we're going to go ahead and get started with uh, questions for Seth. And our first one is from Jason Caldwell. Seth, hey, man, uh, I guess for you, um, what's been your impressions of, of the offense so far? And, and as a wide receiver group, uh, what do you feel like uh, the, that's in store for everyone to, to see out of this offense this year? I uh, feel like um, this year you're going to feel uh, see an explosive offense. Um, like nothing is ruled out. We're going to both pass and throw the ball. So just look for an explosive offense this year. Seth, our next question is from Tom Green. Hey, Seth. Uh, just wanted to see uh, what your thoughts have been of Marco Damio through these first few weeks of practices and how, mu how much have you matched up with him at all? Uh, I messed up with him a few times. I feel like he's a good off corner. He um, still got a little learning to do, but I feel like he's going to be a good corner in the league. Yeah. Our next question is from Justin Ferguson. Hey, Seth, what's the biggest thing you've been working on this offseason that you're trying to improve? Uh, just going up and getting the ball, attacking the ball on, on deep rolls and just really in between routes, like once I get in the route, in between in the route and then going up and getting the ball, I've been working on most this little um, preseason before the season comes. Appreciate it. Our next question is from Nathan King. Hey, Seth. Hey, thanks for talking with us this morning. Uh, when we were talking to Eli, maybe last week, two weeks ago, he said, you look a lot faster. He said, you know, you're in, in good physical shape. You know, how do you feel like you, you worked on your body in the off season? And do you feel like you're in the best physical shape of your career thus far? Um, I wouldn't say I feel like I'm the best in shape, but I just learned during the Corona, during the little pandemic we had, we still in it. But during the off time we had, I learned how to like treat my body, do recovery just to make sure my body is okay. And that, uh, uh, percent to go at maximum capacity every time. I just don't want to just do something, then just go around and sit around. I want to like be productive, proactive. Next question is from Justin Lee. Hey, Seth, I wanted to ask about uh, Kalen Newton. Um, what does he kind of bring to you guys as receivers, both on the field and off the field? Uh, I feel Kalen brings us a, uh, he's like, but uh, physical. I wouldn't believe he played like the believe he played quarterback at on Howard. I wouldn't like expect that because he's so physical and like he changed his game to receiver. Like it's smooth. He did a smooth transition. And I feel like he's gonna be a good contributor for us. And he got hands. He got good hands for sure. Hands. Next question is from Mark Murphy. Seth, what's your impression of how the defense is rebuilding, particularly on the defensive front and in the uh, secondary? Uh, I think they ain't missed too much of a beat, you know, because still he got, he getting them boys right. They, um, we had a lot of people, uh, young talent, like a young, a young, let's see how I say, we had a young, young group play last year. So it just wasn't just all the older guys playing. We got a whole bunch of young guys in there and play. So the experience is there. We just got to rebuild the line. The line looking pretty good right now. So I feel like it's not going to be a drop off from where we was last year. Thanks. Our next question is from Gianna Hahn. Hey Seth, how are you? Um, good, thank you. Um, we were talking to Anthony Schwartz the other day and he was saying that the new receiving class kind of reminds him of you guys when you guys came in. Um, how, what have you seen out of them and has anyone impressed you so far? Uh, yeah, they're around the, um, us of our self regard. Like a lot, me and Flash talk about it all the time. We was like, it's like it's four of them guys, five of them guys came in and they like remind us of ourselves a lot. Like they gonna come in and contribute. Like they big explosive guys, just like they ready to go out there and get out of it. Our next question is from Jared Oliver. Hey Seth, good morning. Um, I'm curious, well you've gotten better year by year. Uh, coming into this year with the new OC, are there gonna be any new wrinkles um, are we going to see anything? Are we going to see anything different from you um, that they're going to use moving forward? You can repeat that. Please. Can we talk up a little bit? Uh, uh, your junior year, um, I'm wondering with the new OC, are you going to be utilizing any different ways? Maybe a little bit more on the offense in some creative ways. 
Uh, yeah, it's just um, we're going to have to wait till the game come to see that. But I feel like um, the offense going to get, like, we moving around. We're moving everybody around in the offense this year. So there's a lot to see from it. Next question is a follow-up from Jason Caldwell. Seth, how, how much more confident are you after these last two seasons uh, going into this year? I know you, you've always been a confident guy, but how much more confident are you that, that you've gone through it for two years and, and know what to expect? I feel like I'm super confident going into this season, my third year back. Uh, new offense, but just the same. Like It's a mindset. You go in with an uh, expectation to win, expectation that you're the best person on the field. And I feel like my mindset this year is to go – all out and just prove to everyone that I am a receiver and that like there's none none left for me to prove and show what I'm about. Our next question is from Brian Matthews. Hi Seth, thank you for doing this for us. Um you're listed as 13 pounds lighter on the roster for this year. Was that something you went to the offseason wanting to do, lose a little weight and how has that affected your play? Uh, yeah, I went in the off season thinking I was gonna um lose a little weight. Didn't expect to lose that much but I gained it back with muscle, so it wasn't too much of a big deal. Uh, but yeah, I kept that. I tried to get it lighter and get faster. Do you feel that way? How how, how have you felt so far this uh, preseason? I've been good. I've been good. I feel good. Lighter on my feet, and that's very good. Trying to get like flash out there and run fast, but you know that can't happen. The boy fast, fast man in the nation. <laughs> Thank you, Seth. I appreciate it. Uh, we've got a follow-up from Justin Lee. Hey, Seth, are, are Bo and Chad Morris meshing? We've heard that they've, you know, hit it off and are meshing well. And is that a testament to them to be able to work together so well, you know, in their first year together? Yeah. Um, coach Morris, he meshed with everybody. He's a he's a good player as coach. Like, it's fun to be around him. When you, whenever you're around him, you're going to learn something. You're going to have fun. It's never going to, like, he's just a good man, person to be around, person, coach, everything. Got another question from Mark Murphy. Yes, I want to ask about um, your late arrival wide receiver, uh, Malcolm Johnson. Has he been able to do much yet? And do you have any first impressions of him? Yeah, he's still getting um, acclimated into things, but he's. Um, I seen him run the other day. He fast too. We're gonna um, be able to use him in a lot of ways too. Do so you think he'll be able to play this year, possibly? Yeah, I feel like all our freshmen, all the freshman receiver players got a chance to play this year. Thanks. Seth, we got a question from Bill Cameron. Seth, if you would talk about uh, what you've seen from Bo, any any uh, changes from last year to this year, and, and, and how's how's everything going with him so far this fall? Uh, seeing Bo, me and Bo and receivers, like we we um gotten better. We um been throwing passes, just been working all in that, but but stay tuned. Like we ain't got nothing to like to talk about. We're not gonna talk about anything yet. We're just gonna show it. First game coming up. So just be tuned to watch it. Does anyone else have questions for Seth? If you do, uh just let me know in the chat. We've got a follow-up from uh, Mark Murphy. Yes, what have you seen from uh, your transfer quarterback, Grant Loy, and the other quarterbacks uh, in addition to Bo? Oh, Grant, he has an arm on. He got a cannon. He likes to throw it. He got a lot of velocity on his ball. I feel like he's a good quarterback, too. And all the other quarterbacks doing good, too. Thanks. Good question from Brian Matthews. Hi, Seth. Uh, thank you for uh, doing this for us. Um, just wanted to ask you about some of the other guys coming back. If you had to pick one guy from your group as the most improved from last year to this year, who would it be? Uh, one guy I feel that's most improved, I say Shed Jackson. Uh, just his, all, his overall, his route running. He's Chris route runner. He um, learned how to catch the ball now, so I feel like he's going to be a good contributor this year for us. I feel like he's improved a lot from last year. I could sort of have a breakout year. Yeah, definitely could have a breakout year this year. Thank you. All right, Seth. That's it, Rob. Appreciate your time. Thank you. Appreciate it.